Nana Mercy. <laughs> yes, my people. Um, before we get into the topics, I'm gonna ask you please hit the like button. And if you're new to this channel, please subscribe. You know what it's all about. Like, share, subscribe, alright? Yes. So right about now is the last day of 2021. And I want to send a warning to um Mr. Vegas, and I'm also going to do a recap of all the stories that made the news for the past three, four months. Yes? So, welcome viewers, welcome subscribers, and yes. So, first, more talk to Mr. Vegas. Because I see Mr. Vegas send send sending some warning to Jashi and I think Mr. Vegas needs some warning himself too and let me put this out there and make it clear and when I bash you Mr. Vegas when I bash you okay we ain't bashing you we just have a little warning brother because I feel like you know what I mean you need this warning because I don't know what's wrong with your family Vegas, he's a big artist. You know? You're a very big artist, Mr. Vegas. You understand? And talented artist too. The problem is, Mr. Vegas, you are not one of them artists who have the streets. You know what I mean? You're not one of those artists who have the streets. You understand, Mr. Vegas? Like, over the years, show the history of dance hall. There's only three DJ that's ever up the streets. Three dancehall artists that has ever up the streets. Yeah? Ninja Man. During Ninja Man time, Ninja Man did have the streets. I mean, Shaba Rankin was the girls' them DJ. Shaba Rankin was the girls' them artist. But Ninja Man up the streets. Ninja Man was the, the youth where every youth want be like want sound like you overs yeah and if ninja man never mess up and get himself into so much bangarang ninja man does still be the original front teeth gold teeth gun panty dan gargan today so ninja man was one of those artists that has ever off the streets he understood the next few is Bounty Killer and Vibes Cartel. No other. Like, all the rest of the artists, them, them, get them time, them get them run, and all of that. But we have artists where up the streets where people are lick off your face right now. If you violate them, brother, they. You understand? Yeah. Bounty Killer and Vibes Cartel. You know what I mean? So, Vegas, you're a very good artist, talented artist, and you can do better things with your time, fam. More than if you sit down on social media like a vlogger, and, you know what I mean, try to disrespect Bounty Killer, put down Bounty Killer, everything Bounty, Bounty, Bounty. You're wasting your time, and, and, and not before long, people are going to start disrespect you, and violate you, and, and, and kiss them teeth, and, you know what I mean, Vegas? So, if you prevent them from happening, brother, find something more productive to do with your time in this new year coming, bruv. You over? Yeah. Bound to kill them out the streets. I feel like you want the streets. You want that street credibility. But I know your thing. You notice you just start out smoke, and if, if a man see how you hold your spliff, that man knows you're yeah, big, yeah, you just start smoke weed. Roger Weed man has them all split. Man does are scared that any man says he says scared him a smoke. Man says I split him all. You know what I mean? Vegas, just be who you are. And just do your music and do what you do and no pay nobody no mind, brother. And, and if you notice, killer not even look at you from. Me see killer pan teach them program, you know. Me see bounty pan teach them program. Teach them. Teach them. Make sure the message reach them. Yeah, I saw killer on it. And Killer spoke very good about you. 
skill like, even when that's say man Vegas good him sort out things with Vegas so I can't see why Vegas can't just forget and forgive and forgive and forget come on Vegas man what are with that man the man call you Mr. Vegas in the interview him never call him never style him never use no no nothing no negative communications you know what I mean so Mr. Vegas your own good brother just forget about bounty killer for a minute please yes i think you should do that you owe it to yourself mr vegas if you stop follow up bounty killer and not try to everything where bounty killer do you go up against it yo you bounty killer do a tune with joshy nothing wrong with that you understand mr Vega? come on man you make people look at you some type of way you know like say you know what i mean come on this is a different place if I listen to him, he interview them now and him talk. He killer is in a different place, brother. And San Vegas, it made no sense. People now killer now pay no mind. People, people no response about where I want to say about killer. Just love it, man. Love it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Just love Mr. Vegas. And me tell you. Me, take me advice. Me warn you, Mr. Vegas. Take me advice. Love it. Low killer. Talk about other things. You're an intelligent guy too, you know. You're a very intelligent guy too. So there are other lot of historical things we can talk about and bring wisdom and knowledge to the people. You understand, Mr. Vegas? Yeah, man. Nobody really come after about killer thing and the styling and all them things, man. That don't make no sense, man. That's not gonna work. You are, you are waste of time, brother. Your precious time. You are waste it, Mr. Vegas. You understand? And sooner or later, you never know you might irritate somebody. Where you know, I mean, a big fan of killer and them probably want to move to your step to your. We don't want them things to happen because the people that we rate you. Are you near Mr. Vegas? Are you seeing Ed's eye? You understand? We are killer did after those lyrical confrontation, dog, and the man style and you for styling back, and that was then. Move forward, Mr. Vegas. Yeah? Lego them things now move forward. You understand? Because I kill him on the streets. You understand? Do the maths. Do the maths. Check the books. No lie no night. No lie no dead. You understand? Yeah. So just make it run, Mr. Vegas. Don't it man. You see me say fam? Yeah. I just that Mr. Vegas, cause you can always waste a precious time at about everything you talk about, about bounty, 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 pedo boy, pedo boy. Then that not make no sense, brother. No make no sense, brother. People are getting irritable. People are getting irritable. See, there, I see a man put out a video where a man has style you. And I say, you know what I mean? That style and I style a sister to one of them things. Are you a car if you go on? I see a man put out a video and style you. And I style your sister and I say, you do this and you do that and all these sort of things, Mr. Vegas. And people say, you have a brand for protect, man. Come on, Mr. Vegas. Better than that, man. A lot of people, they still respect you. You understand? Know you sing some nice songs, but you're not, you're not one of them gangster artists. You, was, you didn't bust as a gangster artist. You never portray yourself as a gangster artist. So no, Killer did that from day one. So that's why Killer have the streets now. You know what I mean? And him, him, him do a lot for you. You know what I mean? Yeah. All right, Mr. Vegas. I wish you a very, very happy and prosperous new year, Mr. Vegas. You understand? And just do the foolishness and take your thing to another level. Alright, my boss? Alright. So, people, we are recap on some of the stories now where, you know what I mean, mash up the YouTube in the past three to four months. You understand? One we are going to talk about is the story of Tanya Stevens and her alleged R.A.P.E. Remember, I did say in a video that I did that I know the perpetrator we know the culprit we, we did we pull off the act and we know it's just because tanya didn't say the name and and legally we can't just say the name because certain things you have to check your lawyer and and you know what i mean you have to check out certain things before you utter certain things because at some serious times now but we know who and i'm going to give you a clue I go and give you no a clue, people. You understand? The artist 
in question. A big artist and a pian pian artist, big artist and artists sing many different types of songs. Muscular artists, you understand? Muscular artists, the artists say, run a place to. The art is an artist say, run the place to. You understand him? Run the place and get him fair share of running the place. You understand? An artist say, bad in a theme time. Uh, lyrically. You understand? When you go do the maths, go back to the giant board, get out the books, do the homework. You understand? Yeah. What do we do at all? We do at all. We ask Google and Google tell we are all. <laughs> you understand? Yeah. So, yeah. And Maka Diamond, which we are alleged beating, people were saying it's Beanie Man. I, I doubt it was a beanie man, to be honest, because unless the beating took place in around mid 90s towards the end, but if the beating was way before that, it could have been beanie man. See what I mean? But we're not going to really assess on that. But the artist is RAPE, Tanya Stevens. Check the clues that we just dropped. You understand? And we know who, which artist exactly. You understand? So, people, hear me. I said, um, time serious. Time is very serious. You understand? Time is very serious. And we just want to wish all of my subscribers, them. I want to wish all the viewers. I want to wish every subscribers, everybody who are supporting every channel on YouTube. Whether it's be our channel, my channel, um, you know what I mean, my bridging them channel. Everybody who's been supporting the channels, the YouTube channels, wanna say much love to and no, wanna wish you know, a very, very happy and prosperous twenty twenty two. You understand? The only thing we wanna ask you know, people for do please is to um for the new year New Year's resolution. One officer, I just love to see the people them interject more love towards each other. You know what I mean? And rid themselves of the negativity. Because guess what we find say. Just last night we had done some studies and I realized say it's the negativity that kind of hold us back, you know. Yes. Like, you know what I mean? I mean competition is good. Competition is good, but disrespect and 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 the, where there's no love, we can't remember you know, people. We are the chosen one, you know. We are the chosen one, and the reason why certain things are reach us in the earth is because we um we um we never keep the commandments. Our four parents, them, and them, they never keep the commandments. And and right now, as we know, like the Bible say, are we have a Turn away from our wickedness. Turn away from all the evil and the wickedness we are doing on earth. And repent. And Father God will do the rest. You understand? Yeah, man. Because we're supposed to shine like a diamond. But we are all back with self and all back each other. We are supposed to shine like a diamond. You understand? We're not supposed to have no bad mind. We're not supposed to be envious. We're not supposed to be jealous of each other. We're not supposed to try to stop one another from progress. We're not, we're not supposed to do that. We weren't really, we were created for that. You understand? We born to help each other, show love, and, and you know what I mean? And make earth a paradise. That's what Jalid want. You know what I mean? That's what Jalid want. If you do show love towards each other, if you have a dollar and this man means 50 cents and you can't give him, give him 50 cents. Don't watch him suffer and laugh and show off. You understand? Because guess what? Where you sow, where you reap. I never see a man plant jackfruit yet and breadfruit appear. I've never seen that. You understood? I've never, ever, 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 ever seen that. So what you sow is what you reap. And what you send out, it comes back. You want good, send good out there. And good will come back. You send bad energy out there, that's what's going to come back. 
bad energy. Learn these things, people. Read the Bible. Study the words. And you know, we know if it's on earth. You understand? And, 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 and religion me are telling about me. And I preach to the idea. See? It's not a religion. I just I say the Bible is a God guideline. You understood? And you will know from whence forth you came. You understood? Yeah, man. And you know what tribe you belong to. And, and you know what I mean? Yeah. Just those things are people. And stay close to the most high. And try on the very best to do less things of the devil. Don't, the, the, the generation are still, you know, we don't know them out of control and them are, them are, them are gravitate towards, the, you know, the sadomitic things and, and, and things of the devil and, and them are because they don't care and it's them, they don't know God and I don't know, we, we not condemn them, we need to pray for them still and, you know, I mean, ask God for, for, for direct them part and, and turn them around just like he did with, um, um, what's his name? You know, my child say, yeah. So people, the earth can be paradise and it can be nice. The earth can be paradise and it can be nice. Give a helping hand. Just give an helping hand. So all you have to do is just give an helping hand. Rather than try to condemn a person. You understand? Because the crabbing and barrel thing we are doing too long. Big up all the people. Them. Big up everybody. We are doing progress. You understand? Next thing we want to stop, stop doing for the new year is to support wrongdoings. Don't support it. Stop support wrongdoings. The plant where you water that are going to bring fruit. The tree that you water and it are going to bring fruit. If you water the good tree, it brings good fruit. If you water the bad tree, it brings bad fruit. Stop support wrongdoings. Stop support wrongdoings. A person is involved in wrongdoings, don't give them any support. Because it's gonna come back at you at some point or some day. If it's not you, it's your siblings. You're overs because mother and father suck the sour grape and it edge the pit in them teeth. Remember that? Mother and father suck the sour grape and it edge the pit in them teeth. You understood? So, the, the wrongs you support, all them people who support the, the, the evil men, them and the the G-U-N men them and and, and, and and the people them with the pan feel like so they them to harm people and shed blood and and people support them and stop it we need to stop it if you do not stop it earth could never get better and it's just gonna be years after years and generations after generations and it's gonna be the same thing and crying and R.I.P. every day and sadness and a funeral and no peace and no love and no paradise and no, no enjoyment you have things that you can't enjoy because you're living in fear it's gonna get worse if we don't stop alright seriously speaking and the eight is the biggest disease eight we have up and we have we, with arms and gloves of too much eat within us. You understand? Yes, keep and say bad mind, I go kill them. You understand? Free your conscience. I mean, stop eating, stop eating. You glow more when you love. Listen to me. We glow more when we love. When your heart full of love and your whole system, immune system, and your whole of your full of love you glow people wonder why you're glowing like that you glow you're full of love no bad energy no negativity no eating on your bone check the books no man no lying on the day you understood no lying on the day and everybody wants to live a nice life and everybody wants to have things and everybody wants to be rich so to speak but them now and you see the energy we are putting in to accumulate material things if we put some of this energy into accumulating peace and love in the earth then we will, re we will reap such reward okay yeah we reap such reward people we have begged the item because we keep getting kids and we keep bringing kids into the world and look for the state that we are bringing kids into innocent kids where they are at where they are at and we go dig them up and pull them out and bring them come into this mess. Only no shame. We are supposed to be ashamed. All of us should be ashamed. From them time till now. From those people to these people. 
we keep bringing babies, every babies, every look at look, there's a pregnant lady, every look at look, there's somebody pushing a buggy, every look at look, there's a little child, there's a, there's a baby being born into the mess that we have created. You understand? So last thing I know. So let me just wish everybody a happy and prosperous 2022. One with productiveness. One with more love. Okay? Yeah. Give us more health, Father God. Give us more strength. Give us more wisdom. Direct our path, Lord. And guide us from the sneer. You understand? Yeah. And protect the kids, them. You understand? Protect the children. Because without them, there can't be no future. Sight. Yeah, man. And people, please, you know, pray for Mr. Vegas. Because it seems like he can't get over this bounty killer thing. And he, he, he take on a wrong thing. He make the devil jump in him and devil at him. You cannot tear down bounty killer Vegas. It's too late. The other man said, nah, retire until he was 60. So that seems like another 10 to 11 more years from now. Okay? So... I'm gonna live good. I'm gonna live good. It's a, it's, a, it's a big cake in a farm. Everybody can get a big piece of slice, big slice, you know. We don't we have a push and show. Push and show days over. The world has changed and things and people has evolved. And there are many different ways and means of making honest living. You understand? All we need to do is support each other. You are doing that, I support you. We doing this, I support you. You are on barbershop, I support you. You are on restaurant, I support you. You are artist, you sing songs, I I, I support you. I, I produce, I, I keep I, I I I keep concerts, you support me. That's what that's you as a blogger, you YouTuber, you know what I mean? You support each other. And there'll be more than enough food. It will be the abundance. You understand? And in the abundance of water, people's thirsty. You know why? Because they are fight each other. We are fighting against each other. In the abundance of food, people are hungry. Because we are fighting against each other. You understand? And then certain people who are live loving with them each other, and them are get all the food, all the chicken. That's my brother. That's all the chicken. And them getting all the chicken. The Chinese and those people who live in love with, the, with each other. I've never heard of a Chinese take up a G-U-N and, and harm another Chinese person. I've never heard of that. I've never ever heard of that. I mean, watch Singapore news every 3 o'clock at night. So we are doing something wrong. We are doing something wrong. I need to take a check. But my love of people, I swear, Love you know, excess amount. You understand? And we just want to be just happy in our earth with God in our heart, all of us. God in our heart. You know what I mean? More righteousness in our heart. You know what I mean? And we're just happy on earth a paradise. Our kids them can play without fear of harm. And you know what I mean? Everybody can come together and wish for that, you know. All of us. Let that be your New Year's resolution. Come together in two and one with God at the forefront and make a wish. I'm pretty for that. Yeah, man. Hear about that incident that happened with, with, with Chakademos. A man black up the, 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 the driveway and Chakademos just toot him on. Toot, toot. It make him not say, listen, can you let me through? And the man ignore him and him toot him on a few more times and the man come out and pop off a G-U-N. Them thing there... Uh, them thing there is uncivilized fam. Them thing make it look like we are still behind the wall. In a, in a time like this, day and age like this, with so much devices and technologies and, and all of these things, we are still behind the wall. That's how we operate. It, too much arrogance and ignorance. You're over us. So we need, we need to change all of these things, man. The mentality towards each other. We need to show love. We need more you material. You, what the word humanitarian you know what i mean yeah 
God create us in our people. I mean, I'm telling this, you know, man, we are, we are, we are grieved God every day, you know, when you know how my next person are being, are being certain way to another person, you know, kind of say, the Bible tells you the way you treat this person, that's how you treat Jai, you know, Jai himself tell her that, you know, the way you treat the man there is the way you treat him. He said, it's the same measure that you use to measure that person. It's the same measure God going to use to measure you. You understand? The same amount of fruit to put in the basket give that person. The same amount of fruit God to put in the basket give to you. You want no fruit, put nothing in the basket give to somebody else. Show love, God show you back love. Show forgiveness, God show you back forgiveness. Vegas, show forgiveness. And Jawi show you back forgiveness. I love no people. See me, I say, yeah. So, again, happy and prosperous new year. And remember, we're coming with bigger and better, brighter content. More laughter this time. You know what I mean? More comical things may come with or forward with whichever we want to take it. Come is an English word. I don't know if some people are chat about still as well as that. But we are going forward with more comical content. You understand? Remember, I'm still in the courtroom. You understand? A lot of things are going in the courtroom because we have kitchen around there. So, so we have people that do look cooking too. You see what I'm trying to say? But stay tuned. Stay tuned, people. And subscribe. 2022, big things in store. All right? Peace and love. All the time.